What's going on, guys? It's your boy Clep from Critics Talk. I am here with the amazing Jeff Anderson. He is the founder, creator of Legion M. Now, I was telling you about these guys earlier on my social media that you need to keep an eye on these guys because they're special. How are you feeling today, man? I am. I love. There's nothing better than waking up and going to a con, as far as I'm concerned. I hear you're a fan. I'm a huge fan. Yes, I, I I love this. It's just it's the the funnest, most creative, most welcoming community I've ever been a part of, and I just cherish it. So so are you a big comic book fan per se, or what, no. what, what, what's your what's your taste of geek? Uh, well, I I would say my holy trinity would be uh, the Lord of the Rings, okay. Star Wars, and Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. Those were the formative books when I were the formative uh, uh, forces. Put all those in a pot and you end up with me. Classic, <laughs> classic, especially, oh, yeah, the book, the book. That yes. was a good one. Um, yes. So tell everybody about Legion M, because I, I only know a little bit about it. I've seen you guys on social media. You pop up in my as sponsored uh, advertisements. And <laughs> Hopefully I was, not in an annoying <laughs> way. No, no, no. That was the first time. This was, this was probably a couple of years ago yeah, that I've seen yeah, this. Yeah. Um, I didn't quite get it, but now I got a grasp of it. Yes. Tell everybody about Legion M. Well, we're the world's first fan-owned entertainment company, and we launched about, it was actually almost exactly three years ago that we launched the company, so we're very new, and the whole idea, it's kind of like everybody at Comic-Con pooled their money and said, let's create an entertainment company of our own, and we produce uh, movies and TV shows and virtual reality. Um, some of them are our own productions, like uh, Girl With No Name, which we're here this weekend. It's available on Kickstarter. Um, and some of them are other people's projects that we invest in. So we invested in the Anne Hathaway movie Colossal. We invested in the Nicolas Cage Mandy movie. And uh, just recently we announced the Kevin Smith, uh, Jay and Silent Bob reboot that they're doing. I cannot wait for that. <laughs> I'm a huge Kevin, fan, uh, Kevin Smith fan. Uh, well, you definitely want to get involved then, because we just, like, just literally, I think a week and a half ago, we sent some of our investors for a set visit to go be on the set while it was filming in uh, New Orleans. And as a surprise twist, they actually brought them into the film and gave them walk-on extra roles in the film. Wow, that's awesome. So how does uh, a person like myself or other fans get involved? Like, how, how do they sign up and how, how much do they got to contribute? That yeah, kind of thing. It's a great question. So first of all, it's totally free. You can join, you can become a member of the community. We've got about 75,000 people or over 75,000 in the Legion as our community. And then from time to time, we, uh, we do fundraising rounds. So everything that we do is regulated by the SEC. It's kind of, it's literally like buying stock in Disney back when it was just Walt and Roy in the very early days. So we're not always uh, uh, open for fundraising and we're not at this moment, but you can join as a free member. And then when the time comes, you can take a look at it. There's a full uh, offering prospectus and there's audited financial statements and all that sort of stuff. But I mean, frankly, for as little as $100, if you choose to, you can invest. You can literally become an owner of the company. And you know, our long-term goal, our logo, the M with a bar over it, is the Roman numeral for one million because our long-term goal is to unite one million fans as the shareholders of the company if you can imagine that would give us hundreds of millions of dollars to produce movies and tv shows that more importantly have a million people standing behind it when they come out and we think that could make us one of the most influential companies in hollywood and you know this is your chance just like i said like buying in the ground floor of disney you can get it in the ground floor and if it works out then you'll own a piece of it now one of the things i think that's amazing about this is because it kind of puts the control in the fans hands yes. um it's like uh they get to say on what they want to see yeah. now how do projects like how do projects get presented now do fans present or does someone have to present to the fans and the fans have to agree it's, it's a great question, and you know it, it's important to, to, to realize. So we're, we're a fan-owned company, and everything that we do, if you're a shareholder of the company, my job as an official of the company, an executive, is to make you happy. And so we work very hard to come up with systems that allow our shareholders to give input and drive the process. Um, a great example is we just did a thing at Sundance Film Festival uh, that was called Scout. And so if you go to Sundance Film Festival, you know, it's, it's a fan festival where you can watch films, but it's also a market where companies like Amazon and Netflix are buying films and filmmakers are selling them. And so we were there on that side. We're not big enough yet to fully buy a film yet, but we partner with people that are. And so we were there to evaluate films. And so if you go to Sundance, there's 120 films at Sundance. And a lot of them are like brand new. Like literally, we were there two years ago with Mandy for the premiere of that, which we invested in. And the editor 
flew from an editing bay in Belgium with the final cut of the film and to a, a, a Starbucks parking lot in Utah to hand it to the projectionist so they could premiere it that night. So they're literally brand new films. So the question is, how do you figure out of the 120 films where you've got maybe a synopsis, you you know who's in it, you know who the director is, but how do you even figure out what you want to see? So, you know, I mean, I could do research for a day and probably become very informed and you have exactly one opinion. But what we did was we built a game that allowed the entire Legion. So we put all the information that was available. Um, and you could, from anywhere in the world, all you needed was an internet connection, you could log in, you could see films, you could rate and evaluate them. And what that did was it gave us data. So rather than one person's opinion or a couple people's opinion, we had over 1,300 people participate. They cast over 40,000 votes so that when we go look at all these films and we're talking with distributors, it's not my gut feel versus your gut feel. There's data that this is what the market is most interested in. Um, so anyway, so that's, that's an example of it. And then what we did actually, which is really cool, is like I said, it was a game. So at the end of it, in addition to giving us your opinion as to you know which of these movies you liked best, we also asked you to predict which one of these was going to be rated higher by the overall legion. And so that your your opinion your opinion is just as valid as mine, right? And so, but your prediction, like we can actually score that. And so we had a leaderboard at the end, and the top five percent of the people were invited to join our elite scout program. And so now when we get opportunities, like uh, somebody comes to us and says, hey, we want you to partner with us on our film, we can share that, not with everybody in the Legion, but we can pull, randomly pull a couple of our elite scouts. And now we have people that have demonstrated an ability to predict what the mass is going to think and use them um, you know, to help evaluate the film. So you know, it, it's a great example about Legion M because you know, everything we do is about trying to involve the community to give our shareholders agency over what we're doing, but also to leverage the wisdom of the crowd so we can make better decisions. Which I think is amazing. It's the same way that critics works. It's not about our opinion, it's about everyone else's opinion. Yeah. So we don't want to take up too much of your time. I really appreciate you talking to us, Jeff. Thank you so much for having me on the Guys, show. make sure you check out Legion M. Where can they find you? LegionM.com. It's totally free to sign up. Check it out. See what you think. And you can follow us on socials. It's Legion M Official. And if you can't find it, go to my page and you can find it there because I've been following them for the last three years. <laughs> All right? Critics Talk, we are out.